every Spider-Man 2 DLC has been revealed and it's all because of a massive mistake that Insomniac made. Basically, the new Game Plus update came out for the game today and Insomniac accidentally left some files in that they really shouldn't have. If you look right here, they've basically left the dev menu in the game and you can still access it now. This pretty much confirmed every single DLC which is coming to the game in the next year or so. But Joe, what are the DLCs? The first DLC is going to be centered around the villain, The Beetle. To be honest, I have no idea who this character is. I've never really heard of them, but at least it's only for one DLC and aren't stretching it out for all three like they did with Hammerhead. The second DLC is going to follow on from one of the storylines we already went through, and that's Carnage. It'll give us a bunch of new missions centered around Carnage, and then eventually you'll have to defeat him. But the biggest DLC is definitely the third one, because the third DLC is centered around the Spider-Verse, and it's much bigger than the rest. Whoa, no way! Not only will there be multiple Spider-Man characters for you to interact with, but there's also going to be Spider-Verse missions, and even a Spider-Verse filter for the game.